there is no longer an arrest warrant for Tina Peters. The election conspiracy theorist turned herself in last night, posed for a new booking photo, and bonded back out of jail. Here's the most recent booking photo of Peters, care of the Pitkin County Sheriff's Office in Aspen. Peters told me today she was in Carbondale, and that's why she turned herself into Pitkin County. She was wanted after sending an email to Mesa County's election director seeking a hand recount of the primary she lost last month. She's not supposed to contact the Mesa County Clerk's Office as part of a protection order and the conditions of her bond in her election tampering case. It was her second arrest warrant in as many weeks. Last week, she traveled to Nevada without a judge's permission in violation of a court order from the election tampering case. The judge gave her a second chance and did not have her arrested. Now she's accused of violating her bond conditions again and was still allowed to bond out of jail instead of being held in custody. We asked 9 News legal analyst Whitney Trailer about privilege and if people in other cases would get this much leniency. These are egregious infractions. Um, there's no question that uh, they were violations. The, the, when she traveled, the judge said, well, I believe in second chances. So, yeah, is this a multitude of chances where in a criminal justice system, others would not get those chances? Certainly, absolutely. By the way, I texted Peters today asking why she was smiling in both of her booking photos and what she's thinking about. She said, and in her return, she said she's smiling because she has a clear conscience and there's nothing that can change that.